So this one's complete? Yes, sir. You got this. Weird comic books. Oh, man. <laughs> Jesse the Body Venture. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's Hogan. Do you have a, a, a price you want to just blow it all out? You just make me an offer, man. Yeah. Yeah, laser disc. Yep. It's a laser disc? No, no, no. No. It's a vinyl album. Like music. Music. Those are mine from when I was a kid. They're from the, the carnival ones, right? Yeah. Uh, I can both for five bucks. So this one's complete? Yes, sir. Bigfoot, huh? Yeah, see, it's not even up. You got the wheels here? I see yeah. three. There's four. Okay. Okay. There should be. Yeah. <laughs> see, I had a tree fall through a building, and that's how the boxes kind of got screwed up. What, what do you have in your bigger ones? 20 on these. These are, these are two packs. There's two carbs in each box. Okay. And then this one, too, is this? Yeah, 20 for that. I mean, yeah. As you can see that was not even open. Yeah. You can bring your Harley shirts out? No. Who the hell wants to wear so many used Harley shirts? This guy does. He, likes, he wears them all the time. Oh, well, I've got a ton of them in my cloth. i got like 40 t shirts. Yeah. Do you wear them all? Or are you like. No. I, well, as you see, I like my older ones. Yeah. You know. So I wear, by the way, try to wear white nuts. I've got these older ones. I got paint on the other one. How much did you say you had in that one? 20. 20? Let's say you found 30 shirts in your closet that you wanted to get rid of. I imagine you have 30 that you don't even give two shits about yet. What would you sell 30 shirts for? I love Harley shirts. What's this? When are you going home? Well, I mean, if you want, I just live up on one twelve. Do you really? Yeah. So if you want, I can. It's supposed to rain when I tell tomorrow, so yeah. I'm not setting up tomorrow. But I can be changing time. Hey, future out here. I don't know if you guys hear the conversation that the Death Pile Pickers having in the background. The vendor here was actually selling some Harley parts. The guy said he had like thirty something Harley shirts he wanted to get rid of, and he told him he'll buy them for two bucks a piece. So this is huge. He invites us to come to his house the next day, and what do you see? What we find at the end of this video. Did you replace these? No, that's the original patch. Oh. On the box of this so as they were talking i started scanning a lot of these models and they were going anywhere from like 10 to 15 20 bucks a piece wasn't a lot of profit being made since he was asking ten dollars each yeah yeah definitely a big foot i almost want i was gonna make an offer for everything yeah that's a good one right now it's not i thought it was it's never been this slow. You can see it's still wrapped up. Nah, not good at all. Not much about Harley's stuff. Sir, what do you have on this? I would do 15. 15? Yep. Do, do 10? I'll buy the big. I'd buy the Bigfoot too for 15. Okay, then fine. Okay, <laughs> yeah, I like that. <laughs> I like the oh, wheel and deal. I like people that like the wheel and deal. So. Well, I mean that's what it's all about. Yeah, absolutely. So. <laughs> What do you have in the Funko? I would do five bucks. Five bucks? Give me five bucks for it. I don't know it. anything about it. Like I said, a lot of the stuff, my buddy died. Oh, sorry to hear that. 60 years old, died of pancreatic cancer. Oh, I'm sorry. I helped him load up a $60,000 toolbox full to his buddy's, on his buddy's truck. Yeah. He gave his Harley away, gave his truck away. He gave me all this stuff. I mean, wow. he didn't have a wife or kids. and. Gave every bit of it away. He gotcha. hated his brother and he didn't want his brother to get it. What do you have on uh, these cars? Now these I'm doing 25 piece. 25 piece? Yeah, a guy across the street already bought two of them. Okay. I bet. And they, they come bet. with the paperwork mm -hmm. and the yeah. other half of the box. So. How much you want on this one? It's a hard castle. Oh, just 10 bucks. Really? With the box? <laughs> Um, yeah, all the no. little ones up doing ten bucks. So where are you guys from then? If you're traveling through, I'm from Virginia. I'm from Tampa, Florida. Say car ramrod. Say car ramrod. I have a ten if you want. I have a ten. Uh, the low rider magazine that just catches your eye. Uh, Pina green. Yeah, yeah, it comes factory green. It's a cool looking model, ain't it? Yeah. Hey, 
you just never know. Yeah, you yeah. try all the good stuff. I mean, yeah, some, some some of these are going for like 15, 20. Some are going for 30. Right. You know what I mean? So well, I try to. It. That's why you know if, if I can, I buy to resell a lot of times. If, if I could find some wiggle room in certain things. Yeah. I don't want to pack this boring. shit back up. You know how it goes. <laughs> You didn't do it already. But you try to look at the stuff on yeah. eBay and stuff like that, and then people have these prices. Yeah. And you know the wrong Facebook. Yeah. And a lot of those guys sell these for fifteen yeah, plus yeah. shipping. It just takes. It's just. It's just time consuming to yeah. get rid of them all. Yeah. Yeah. You know well, that's I mean? just it. You got to ship you this. Have the other boxes for those. Yes, sir. And I have to pay for it. What do you? What do you the, do? These are Franklin Mint. I said you just never know. It's hit all right. So this I one is with this. Yeah. Yes. All right. So right now I had fifteen, twenty, thirty. 50. Yep. Would you do 90 total? Do 20 piece of those and not, instead of buying it all? I could do that. Perfect. All right. You owe me 20. Okay. He's going around all kinds of money, ain't he? Do you have 10 on you, sir? Uh, yes. There we go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Now, the only question left is which one would you get? Which one what? We can we, we can fits in the big box. Is we can we can flip a coin. Oh, you got to flip a. You get a coin. Yeah. This is the one. Oh yeah, I might have a coin. Which one? Which, which mean that is, is, is that the one you want? Which one do you want? Do you want to flip a coin? To make it fair, I'll take this. You want that one? I mean, unless it's a big difference. I don't think so. I, we, have, we can look when we get back. Yeah, I got four. Uh, you want to flip a quarter? <laughs> so what is it now? So. Well, how do I, you want to do it? I'll, we will flip I it. I'll let you call it. and you get to choose which one you want. Okay, all right, that's good. We'll do Let's this. Okay. Hey, hey, is this yours? All right. So, right. Call, whoever wins. You call in the air. Whoever wins gets to choose. Gets to choose. All right, go ahead. You want to hit the ground? You, you hit the ground. We'll hit the ground. Okay. Heads. Oh, hit the table. Heads. Heads it is. I'm taking a chance on this one. You're taking a chance on that one? All right. I get the small one. Good. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. We make reselling fun, right? Okay, you're taking this sure bet. I'm Hey, is this yours? No. No, I can't get it. Okay. You should tell him to buy it. Thank you so much. I should tell him to buy it. <laughs> yeah. You're welcome. Come on, dear. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> come on, sir. Come on, Foxy. <laughs> what do you have for that? It is. Um, 30 bucks. 30 bucks. Does it? Man, let me. On, on, on Amazon? Yeah. Let me look it up. Yeah, that's a uh, 700 piece, a thousand, uh, a thousand piece of like. What we got in here? It's ephemera. I have to talk over this part because they're blasting music inside, but I'd like to give a big shout out to Mike the Death Pile Picker for finding this bodybuilding magazine from 1958 from Joe Reeder. Joe Weeder was the Arnold Schwarzenegger before there was an Arnold Schwarzenegger. So if you guys do come across any of the old stuff from like the 50s and 60s, it actually does sell pretty well online. So keep a lookout. All right, guys. So Death Pile Picker found this, handed it off to me. You guys aren't familiar with him. One of the goats in bodybuilding. And this is just super cool. Look at that. How to build strength and muscle. We paid $1 for this. Exactly what it would cost <laughs> back in. Let me see how. What year is this? 1958. Cost one dollar in 1958, and is what we paid today. Cent boosters. No, that's what they go with. Ah, oh, gotcha. Are you sure I'll get the break? Mini buzz pencil sharpie. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Another football. Another football should have had. Oh my god. <laughs> How you guys doing? Good. How are you? Doing good. Nice to meet you. Rod. Can't wait. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Sir, nice to see you again, man. How are you? Good, man. Good. Hey, how's it going? Going well. Going well. Boy, man, you got a nice shot. You got a cool place in here. Yeah, it could be better. The mower sits in the container, but I'm. Yeah. Change the blades and I'm re greasing everything. Oh, yeah, awesome, man. I like it. But well, that's what's left of the mower. Yeah, so I'll must... get the shirts and stuff. Oh, awesome, okay. man. Sure. Perfect. So, did you guys find anything? We did. It was a little rough today. It was that we started off rough. And then, I don't yeah. think a lot of people saw it just because the weather's so. Yeah. Just, uh, like I said, there's, these things are in great shape. Oh, yeah. I buy them because I, I think they'll look good. But then when I put them on, I'm like, they suck. <laughs> They're all the so. same size?
Yeah, they're all two inches. They're all two inches. Yeah, my size. Okay, cool. <laughs> all right. And some are like brand new. Yeah, they've never been see. more. This like this one. one I saw in the picture. Never been more. Tape the bottom? Is that tape on the bottom of that one? I'm sorry? Is that tape? Oh, just tape. For yeah, it's tape for me mm -hmm. in the garage. Yeah, it's a, fabric tape. Yeah. That's all. That's a cool one. Yeah, I, I like think it's brand new. I like this one. I, I, I will split them, so I'll, I'll pay for it, and then he may what, want those. What do you ask for the shoes? Whatever you, I don't just make me an offer. It's, uh, um, I agree. Will you do ten bucks a pair? Yeah, that's fine. Right, like yeah. I said, I give them away. They're not going anywhere. There you go, man. So, appreciate that, man. I appreciate it. I know they had. What's your name again? My name's Rod. Rod. Yeah. So I appreciate, <laughs> it, man. You got any, anything else that you're looking to get rid of? Yeah. I know you had these cars and stuff yesterday and stuff like yeah. that. They're just, a lot of times, some of them are going for like 10, 15 bucks. Right. Do you have a, a, a price you want to just blow it all out? You just make me an offer, man. They're never going to get built. Yeah. They're, and here's the reason. I used to build models. Yeah. But then you go on, I belong to Facebook websites. Mm -hmm. And these guys are phenomenal. Yeah, they, yeah. I mean, they do beautiful work. So I hate to ruin them yeah, by yeah. being an idiot. Yeah. So. Was it like thirty something here? Yeah. One, two, three, four, eight, fifteen, fifty-two. Fifty-two. Yeah, I started off with seventy. Yeah, yeah. So. How'd you guys do at the sale yes yesterday? You do okay? I made three hundred and fifteen bucks. bucks. So I mean. I mean. It for, didn't cost me nothing. I didn't yeah. have to pay for a spot or anything. Yeah. You said about fifty of them there. Yeah, there's fifty-three. I would be probably around like one hundred fifty bucks for them all. I got you. Yeah, some of that ball and I. Just for the fact, it's going to take a long time for me to sell. I mean, it takes a oh, lot of yeah. space, you know what I mean? So if that's something you were looking just to get rid of, I, I'd right. be doing something like that. Um, but just, because I mean, even by this season, they're selling for 15 after I pay fees. Right, right. Yeah, you know, so, but. And if you don't want to. 175 for them all? Ooh, 175. 25 bucks more. 25 bucks more. Maybe yeah, ask, my, maybe see, maybe ask my buddy if he wants to get in. Yeah. Mike, do we, do we got room? <laughs> if I buy it all. Okay, make room. Um, by any chance, do you have a tote I can put in? And I, I'll, well, they, it takes up five totes. Oh, it takes up five totes. Yeah, I got you. Oh, got you. I figured we'd take them out so you could see yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, you can only get like nine in a yeah. tote. Really? Yeah. Nine in a tote? They don't take, they take up that much from like these ones? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, if you, because if you set them... Well, maybe put them sideways. Yeah, but they actually fit more. Oh, damn. Because yeah, you can do this, uh, yeah, yeah. and then you can put two uh, here. Yeah. Kevin, you want you want to buy some models? I don't. You don't? I said 150 bucks for it all. It's 50 something total. 50 of them. Money to be made. I know. Money to be made for you, but it's... Yeah. Yeah, they were slower sellers for me. Um, but there's some that are still sealed. Yeah. Stuff, so you know. So that, what else you guys look for? Uh, sports cards, comic books, video games, um, old T-shirts, anything that's like collectible, anything we think we can, you know, make some money on stuff Rob, like that. Are you looking to split a deal because you don't want? To you don't want to deal with no, it. No, because well, you're here. 150 because for, Because you're here. I was going to say, hey, if you're interested in... I, yeah, I would do it for you if no, that's what you want to no, do. No, no, no. I, I mean, I, I, I can buy them this it, myself. You, want, you got it. Yeah, I mean, I've sold a lot of models over the years. Um, what are these? They're, they're bigger double packs. Are yeah, yeah, they're okay. So, yeah. what do you got there? Well, your comic books. Oh, man. All right. <laughs> Let me see. I mean, oh, these yeah, were when I was a kid. Yeah, Sergeant Rock Disney here, Planet of the Apes. Started. Yeah, there's no Superman or yeah, yeah. I want the uh, superheroes except Captain Carrot. Captain Carrot? <laughs> Not Captain Caveman? No. Yeah, you never heard of Captain Carrot? No. Yeah. Look at that. Just a lot of weird shit for me. <laughs> yeah. 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 But I do have a bunch of trading cards. Do you? Yeah. You looking to get rid of them? Yeah. Trying to think where they're at. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we can. It's a lot of work. Yeah, Should I not? Should I? Tell, tell me not to buy it. But you know what? These I probably get 30, 40. Tell me not to buy it. I probably get 20. Rod, don't any, buy it. I probably get like 30, 40 bucks, some of those. Yeah. And then some of the other ones, I can always put them in bulk and just bulk them out too. How many total? 
fifty something. Yeah, I mean you're gonna make money yeah. on it. You're gonna make. I'm not gonna lose money. Three hundred dollars minimum on it. It's just. Yeah. It's quite a bit of work for. They're gonna hang around a little bit. Yeah. But there's money. There's a bunch of different trading cards. Okay. What's that thing? This is uh, Princess Diana stamp. Oh yeah. Okay. I've never seen them before. I'll look them up. See what they got. 1980. Like I said, I got all these weird shit. Oh, yes. Iron Sheik. Iron yeah, Sheik so wrestling cards. cards. Those are all yeah, WWF yeah, yeah. cards. Yeah, these are from the yeah. 1986. Yeah. They're all from that era. Yeah. They're extra shit from when I was a kid. <laughs> She's looking for my Star Wars cards. Okay. Grease. Rocky. Rocky. Cartoons. Star Remember the comic books cartoons? Yeah. Yeah, crash and burn, or crash and burn. C3 is mm. company, and then some weird stuff. In there. Yeah, <laughs> what is this? No one throw more. Those used to come <laughs> yeah. in for Wonder Bread. Yeah, the, the yeah. cards from 1984. Andrew John Jackson. Jackson. Yeah, they're all president cards. Yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> Let's see if there's anything in here that's. Yeah, I can't tell you if anybody in here is worth a flip or not. Well, this is 1980, so 1980 would be... Walter Payton and then... Oh, well, it'd be a Walt... Well, that's not his... His rookie was in the late 70s. Uh, uh, you would have Phil Simms' rookie years, I think, in 1980. Uh, I think that's... Yeah, I have no idea. Phil Simms, the old quarterback. I got Terry Bradshaw. Yeah, you have Bradshaw. You have other stuff in here. But Phil Simms would be, like, the, the main rookie. Uh, there's Ed Tutal Jones. So what you can do that? I'm much... I'm much... I like the wrestling cards much better. But... Just because it's my childhood. Sure. How old are you? I'm 54. Okay, 54. So you're yeah. a little older at this then. That's why I'm trying to weed out stuff. Yeah. My kids don't want this shit. You know. Rowdy Roddy. I get Rowdy Roddy when you buy it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Let me give him this five while you're de sure. deliberating. Over she, there. She's looking for my Star Wars. If okay. you're interested. Yeah, in Star yeah, no, I, I would yeah, be interested. I bought a bunch of Star Wars cards the other day. Yeah. Oh, you did? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah, right, we, we, we gotta see what's Disney. in here. Let's, let's see here. Iron mm -hmm. Sheik, Junkyard Dog. Yeah, it's Hulk Hogan's Jesse. in there. Jesse the body. Is it? Oh, yeah, it is Jesse. There's Hogan. Yeah. There's, oh, Captain Lou Albano. Captain Lou is Santa. Santa. Uh, there's Piper and uh, uh, Rocky. Rocky no, that's Rocky no, Johnson. Right, Rocky, Rocky Johnson. Johnson. Iron Sheik. Ivan Polsky, the Polish Power. Iron Sheik. Mr. Fuji. <laughs> Wendy <laughs> Rich. Jesse the Body Venture. Yeah, yeah, there's Hogan. Horned off. Valentine. See, I got my Jimmy Hart shirt on right there's here. There's the Piper. Oh, yeah. Chief J, Jimmy Snooker, Big John Stud. I love that. That's, I love that crusher junkyard and dog. Yeah. And the junkyard. Yeah. And the crusher. Like, <laughs> look at that. So yeah. that's when the Andre Giant went. So Andy Andre Cat Giant matches. used to tour around the country and they would actually book him in matches for. They call them midgets back then, but right. small little people, and yep. they would just have him wrestle like Aren't five, six people. At a time. I don't know. This is my favorite Hulk Hogan card of all time, where he punches his hand through. through the radio. You see this right here? Through the <laughs> radio. Yeah, that's pretty good. Well, these are Star Wars. Oh, yeah, sir. They're they're eighty. Yeah, yeah, I bought them. Or seventy-eight. The yeah. Yeah, they're all like I said. The, all this stuff from then when I was a kid. What would you do for the comic books, the cards, and then everything? If I bought the would comic we, books, the cards, say it first? you want? I said one fifty. You counted at one seventy five, and I said if we if, if we added. Oh, you the, want that stuff too? Yeah, for everything on the table. Oh, every, well, you already paid for the shoes. Yeah, the shoes. Yeah, and so, he, and, and, and his stamps. I'm not trying to. You. Yeah, what would you just do for bulk? I would for do all? two. Two hundred for everything. Would you do two? I'll do two. I, I at this point, you got me with the uh, the wrestling cards. Oh. <laughs> the cards. No, but you've been super cool with us. Invited to your house, man. I'll, I'll give you the two hundred. Oh yeah. No, I, I, you know, uh, one of the pickers, he lives in, he's from Joliet, where I'm from. Now, are you putting, is this in that deal, or is this? No, yeah, he was pointing to the stuff okay, on the table. Okay, that's what I'm checking, but it was. And I'd be fine with that. 200 bucks. And, and if you want it, you can buy them off here for 10. No, man, you can have it, man. Okay. We're, we're all here, this is, there's enough love to go around for everybody, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right, did you have a 10 in there, if I give you 20? No, I got, I got money in the okay. I'll give you more. Let me throw this in the back. Let me just give you one. Yeah, no Dude, I can throw some in the back seat. I can throw some in the back seat. Uh, we got room back here or no? I'm gonna make some. Oh crap! Could we put some in the totes and I give? I'll buy the totes from you. I'll give you money for the totes. 
You can just have the totes. Are you sure? I'll yeah. give you cash for the totes. Huh? I'll give you cash for your totes. Well, I mean, it's up to you guys. Yeah. You know, it'll I mean, take about four or five of these bags. Yeah. So I just, I just think it might be easier for us to put sure. stuff in the truck. Be concerned about. Well, like I said, I had a tree fall through my building. Yeah. And that's what screwed up there. some of these model boxes. All right. Well, then we got that one there. When this tree fell, you couldn't even Did see it, the building. You bought, you bought these, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you guys set everything on the table. Yeah, okay, cool. So you can probably fit those comics lamp in there, too. Yeah, I'll put those inside. I don't want them to get damaged. Because I don't want them sliding around or oh, something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That might, that might squeeze right there. No, I don't think it's no. going to. All right, do you have the top for this one here? Oh, yeah. It's either this one or the there. other one. What do you want for the for the for the totes then? I don't know that. Well, how many we got? Two, I have two. This would be three. three. I think we can be good. Good, just the three. Five bucks a piece. I mean, does that sound fair? Yeah, that's fine. Do you have a? Actually, just keep it, man. I don't remember what I paid for. Yeah, they're probably like. I know, I know totes went up during the pandemic yeah, a lot. They used to be a lot cheaper though. Yeah, oh, yeah. Had some I used to, I used to buy them for like five bucks a piece. Yeah. So I don't know. I haven't bought totes in like probably two years, three years now. But just hey, how about twenty bucks for three totes? Well, oh, thank you. No, thank you, man. All right, so I, I got a question to ask you. Yes, sir. If it was yesterday, yeah, and I made you an offer to buy the whole table yesterday, would you have sold it yesterday, or would you yeah. wait? To, you would have sold the whole thing oh, yesterday. Yes. Because I, 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 I don't want to throw it away. Yeah. My kids aren't interested. You know what I mean? So it'll sit here yeah. until I die. And yeah, then I got she's you. got to deal with it. <laughs> yeah, so I, that's, I have no sentimental value yeah. to any of this shit. I got you, I'm man. 54. I had an absolute blast picking with the Death Pile Picker and Common Picker at the Peaches the Beaches, the highway sale up in Georgia. This is why networking is so important, guys. When you guys go to garage sales, go to highway sales, talk to the vendors, network them, see what else they have. You know, because we did that, you know, we were able to go out to this guy's house. We went there originally, pick up all those Harley shirts, and then I ended up getting, you know, all those cards and end up getting all those models. It's going to be a lot of work. They're going to take a while to sell, but I should make probably about 400 bucks in all those models. Somewhere in that ballpark. It's going to be a lot of work, but, you know, probably the best pickup, though, from this whole thing was my favorite. Those 1984 Tops wrestling cards. I had those as a kid. There was a Hulk Hogan rookie card in there. It was a, none of those cards were in good condition. So the card's probably like a $20 or $30 card, but it's such a nice surprise. Thank you guys so much for watching. You know, this is actually the last video for the Peaches of Beaches, but we have plenty of other great videos. So please go check out the other videos and make sure you guys like and subscribe. Until next time, make sure you guys keep picking and punching.